To understand the difference between the two different mouse tools, uh, I have gone ahead and I've drawn a vector design to demonstrate the differences. The first one is called the transform tool. And in the earlier video, I showed you how to drag, resize, and rotate objects using this transform tool. What it does is it selects the entire shape or the entire image uh, within your document here. So when I click on it, I'm selecting all the lines and points within this J graffiti artwork here. This mouse pointer, the second one, is called the edit tool. That is only for manipulating vector design. So if you were to import a raster image, like the coffee mug example from an earlier video, it would not have any effect. But because this is in a vector design, notice how when I go over the outline here, it kind of highlights red. This allows me to edit individual points. So I can actually select individual points within my design here and edit them one by one, rather than selecting the entire shape like the transform tool. This is a good way to go ahead and connect dots or connect points or just fix things after they had already been drawn. So if you were to draw a line, you can go back and you can add curves to it by simply clicking and dragging and really changing and editing your vector shapes after they've already been drawn and created. 